Hey, 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 good morning, everybody. It's for me, it's Friday right now. It's raining outside. And so I'm feeling really good right now. I'm happy, I'm healthy, and I hope you guys are too. Okay, I hope you guys are doing really well. I hope you guys are having a good day, a good week, and things are going good for you. Okay, uh, I want to talk to you guys about the month of February. Okay, it's the second month of the year now. Okay, it's the month of February. By the time you guys will see this video, and every February is a is a special celebration. Okay, the month of February has a special celebration, and that celebration is called the celebration for Black History Month or African American History Month. Okay, now this celebration started because a doctor way back in the day felt that. Black Americans needed to have some recognition for all the great things that they did for the history of the United States, right? And there was so many great things that they did, okay? And they still keep doing today, okay? So he thought, oh, let's celebrate it in a week, right? And he, and yeah, a lot of schools started celebrating a, a week of it. And then later on, there was a president who said, oh, wait, we may, we may need a whole month, okay? So he dedicated the month of February to Black History Month. And uh, and so today we are gonna watch a little video about one of the heroes in Black history. And she's not even just a hero in Black history, she's a hero in American history, okay? Uh, this lady you may have heard of, her name is Harriet Tubman, okay? She's about to be placed on a $20 bill as part of uh, uh, the pictures that they put on the money, okay, to honor her. So today, we're going to watch a little video about her life story. It's a little, one of those little books that you read along with on on uh, YouTube. So please just be patient, take in the information, realize that she is an American hero and she deserves to be celebrated and realize, uh, think about what, what she did uh, that was so courageous and, and allows us to celebrate her as an American hero, okay? So I need to present my screen to you so that way you can see what I'm seeing. Hold on a second. My computer takes forever. Forever. Okay. Let me see. Here we go. I think now we're good. Okay. I'll make this big. Harriet Tubman escaped from slavery. She vowed she would fight to free all slaves. Her perseverance inspired Americans to stand up for equality. Harriet Tubman, written by Marion Dane Bauer, illustrated by Tammy Lyon. Harriet Tubman was born in the United States of America. She was born a slave. Her parents were slaves. Her brothers and sisters were slaves. To be a slave meant that someone else owned you. That person can make you work very, very hard. That person could even sell you like a sack of potatoes. Harriet didn't want to be a slave. She wanted to be free. When Harriet was grown, she ran away from the South where she had always lived. She traveled at night following the North Star. She trudged through woods and swamps. Some good people helped her reach the North where no one was allowed to own slaves. At last, she was free. But her parents and her brothers and her sisters were still slaves. So Harriet made the dangerous journey to the South again. She brought her sister and her sister's two children back north with her. She traveled south many times, always hiding, always moving at night. 
she brought hundreds of slaves to freedom. She brought her brothers and her parents too. Then, in 1861, the North went to war with the South. Harriet became a nurse, a cook, and a spy. She even led troops to rescue more slaves. When the Civil War ended and the slaves were freed, Harriet worked for rights for women, all women. She also set up a home for old and poor black people. She brought her parents to live there. Harriet Tubman was born a slave, but she didn't stay a slave. She became a proud, strong, free woman. Harriet Tubman is an American hero. All right, you guys, so you saw how Harriet Tubman was born. Uh, she was born during a time where the United States was in an ugly part of their history where we would treat people as slaves, right? And to be a slave meant that you had no freedom of your own. You had no choice to do what you wanted to do. All you could do was what your owner wanted you to do, okay? So uh, Harriet Tubman freed herself by running away, and then she came back to help other people run away and get out of slavery too, okay? So she is an American hero, and I want you guys just to realize a little bit uh, about her story and how courageous she was, how brave she was, and how she fought for other people besides her to make sure other people had a better life, right? And then even after the whole slavery thing was over, she fought to make sure women had the same rights as men, right? And that's a courageous American hero. So that's all I have for you guys today. Uh, during this month, we'll probably explore a couple more heroes, okay? I want you guys to have a good, safe week uh, and enjoy yourself. And remember, take care of yourselves, okay? Wear your mask, wash your hands, uh, do all the good stuff, okay, you guys? I'll see you later. <laughs>